To Saba, and with me here is the Maris Duma Tado. In today's video, we will be talking about our traditional cultural attire, which is called Egopara and Zongo, and also we'll be talking about the significance of Nupe food to the world. Although there are many Nupe traditional cultural attires that are being used, but the most used are Egopara, which I'm putting on, and Zongo. We also have Fini and many more. Para is being derived from a fish called Egoki in the sense that the back of the fish has the same design as this wrapper. While Zongo is derived from a dry guinea corn stalk, which is dyed into different color and being crafted into a mat. Mat in Nupe language is known as Zongo. The design on the mat is where the print of this dress is gotten from. We talk about the significance of Nupe food to the world. The goal and objective of this platform is to promote Nupe culture. Research has shown that Nupe people are the third most educated in Nigeria. With these findings, Nupe people have been underrated in Nigeria. Reasons being that Nupe people are early migrates. Majority of them reside in the north central part of Nigeria in states like Kwara State and Ninja State. Due to the low level of migration of Nupe people in Nigeria and the fact that Nupe people don't spread across the states of Nigeria like the outside Yorubas and Igbo do. As a result of low level of migration of Nupe people, we decided to come up with this idea of making videos to promote our culture to put our culture not only across nigeria but to the world hope you enjoyed watching and have learned something new about nupe culture we remain the marriage dumatado and tabita yetu saba we love, love you, you. Oh, no. 